Welcome to Tales of Arise, it's Abyss, and in this video, I'm going to show you the locations to all 20 elite monsters. Now this is going to help you unlock the trophy slash achievement called Big Game Hunter. So the way I set the video up is, we're going to start with the lowest level monster and then we're going to work our way all the way up. The first one is going to be at level 13, and then the last one is going to be at level 56. I recommend doing this way because you want to farm these guys as soon as possible so that you can get the extra 10 CP points. Every time you defeat one, you're going to gain that 10 points. This is going to help you out as you progress through the game. This is something that I wish I did earlier and not in the post game. Now in the description below, I'll have timestamps for each one, just in case you want to jump to any part of this video. And with the timestamps, you'll see the level of the monster along with the monster's name. So if you want to see which ones you have already defeated, go into your menu, select field guide, and then enemy info, and then tab over twice to the right. This will list all of the elite monsters. Other than that, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to support the channel, and I will see you next time. Out of my way! Don't let it go! 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 Maybe there's someone around here. Can't chase after every little thing. Finally made it. I see. <laughs> Eventually. Compassion can make all the difference. I propose we speak to them. Huh? Kisar. Right! I'd say we're about evenly matched.
There might be someone who could use our help. Good. What, Siri? <sighs> That Zugal looks tough, but... I think we're game for it, yeah. Alright, so the next one on the list is the Great Dragon. This one kind of threw me off early in the game. All of a sudden I was fighting some regular enemies and it just dropped in and decided to join the party. What you're supposed to do is you're supposed to start this side quest that I'm going to show you right now. Talk to the guy and then you'll probably get a marker which will take you right to the Great Dragon. I don't know if it's intentional where they just show up randomly or if it's like the other ones where you talk to the guy at the side quest and then they'll tell you the location you need to go to. This is the only one that was kind of weird. So I'll show you the location where I found the Great Dragon, and then I'll also show you the location to the side quest that you're supposed to go and start. Okay. Huh? Here we go! Hmm. Maybe you, you did it. Calm down, dude. <sighs> Let's hurry. All right. Huh? <laughs> you did it! What it?
be someone who could use our help. Got it! Right. <laughs> I think we're game for it, yeah. Own? No way! I need your help! Fear! Pierce the evil! down don't get careless Good. <laughs> I see. read the landing that thing looks pretty menacing ah nothing we can't handle <sighs> that thing looks pretty menacing. Ah, nothing we can't handle. Yeah. Hey. Hey. 
<sighs> hmm. Good. What? Maybe there's someone around here who needs our help. Right! What the small stuff? Oh, it's no skin off my nub. Thanks! Right, like who <sighs> got it. Is this the barrier that's keeping the Zoogle in that Nath mentioned? Did they really think that barrier was enough for a Zoogle? Careful. That's no ordinary Zoogle. Yeah? Well, we're no ordinary party either. Agreed. Very nice. Is this the Zoogle from the request? It's not only alive, but completely uninjured. We'll just have to see for ourselves. Got it. Very well. This is the Vicent training. Seriously? I bet that one could give me a decent workout. You're planning to fight it alone? No way! I need your help.
reach this ultimate Zugal of theirs. Zugal looks tough, but... I think we're game for it, yeah. 